Hey guys, welcome to today's video. I'm Trust Stanley and this is a TS Tech Talk video. So on today's video, I'm going to be answering common question that people usually ask about threads. I actually wanted to make this video when it came out, but it's not an issue. So the first question is, what is the difference between threads and Instagram? Now, currently, this is threads. You can see how it's displayed, right? You can see how the images are displayed. Now, I don't know if you have noticed, guys, if you see um, multiple images on threads where it has uh, multiple, like multiple posts on threads where it has multiple images, like four images, you can see how the images are displayed. Actually, um, the images are not the same, like fitting very well. You can see how the images are displayed. Now, um, the reason why the images are not displaying properly on threads is actually because the platform actually created threads for test based only platform. But funny enough, people upload short videos and images on threads. Now, you can notice this video, this picture, right? Now, if you scroll, on this picture you can notice how um it overlay on the threads there is a straight um icon right there there is a straight line right here and it enters inside of it you can see so it actually means that they did not make this for images now if you go on instagram you are going to notice a little bit different um different features you can see how everything um, lines up you can see perfectly this is a perfect image this is a perfect picture based platform and you can notice the test actually if you see test on instagram you will have to click on more to read more of those tests now these are tests so but then it's actually quite different on um you can see how the tests are displayed right it's actually quite different on threads so threads is actually made for test base not image base although people are um uh, abusing it right now putting images with pictures which is not necessary you can see how this test displays properly right if it's a test as long as this on instagram you will have to click on read more or you have to click on more before you'll be able to see more of this test such as this now um the next question people usually ask is this um how can i verify threads now i've already answered that on my previous video but i'm still going to say that on this video you cannot verify threads right from this platform now this is actually cbn right now this is how many followers cbn has and they have actually reached the requirement but this profile is actually not verified here this profile is actually linked with instagram so it actually comes with the verification that came from the instagram platform but then i'm not following this person so that's the reason why i cannot see their instagram um icon or their instagram profile but if i'm following them i'm definitely going to see it just like youtube let me search for youtube right now so this is youtube and i'm already following youtube um i think they actually customized their so it not actually showing me the um youtube followers adding the icon to actually navigate to instagram but i'm actually following youtube here and also on the other platform so um i think there is something i, I will actually have to um look at because um i just noticed that this particular uh this particular profile does not have an instagram account i'm actually going to check that and show you guys the reason and tell you guys the reason why there is no option for instagram but then um let me continue but actually um the only reason why all of these guys has uh, verified already is because they are coming from instagram now the next question people usually ask is can you use threads on your computer but then um the question is um, no, you cannot use threads on your computer because um, there is no version, there is no PC version for um, threads right now. You can only use threads as a mobile application and it works on both iOS and Android. So that is actually interesting. And then the next one is what data does threads collect? Now, so many people have been making a lot of video about the data um, that threads collect. Now, threads collect a lot of information, but I'm just going to abbreviate this and say threads collect every data that your instagram is collecting so there is nothing different between threads and instagram they collect the same amount of data but then you are going to be noticing some information from other websites telling you that threads collect your medical report and other stuff 
actually they do not do that threads collect the same data that your instagram is collecting and you can look up instagram um instagram data and you'll be able to see what they are collecting and then the next question is um can i import my instagram followers to threads and that is actually a no you cannot import your instagram followers to threads but then when you um create a threads account and then you make use of the same profile people that uh people that you are following on that profile you're going to see them you'll be able to follow them and then later on people that are following you whenever they join threads platform they are going to see notification of you and they'll be able to start following you also and then um another question is um can I share GIF on Threads? Yes, you can share GIF on Threads right now. I think most people are already sharing videos and they can share GIFs, but you cannot share every GIF. Like for instance, this is a video, but you cannot share every GIF on like, um, other, on like Instagram. So there are some kind of GIF that you'll be able to share and there are some that you will not be able to share. So you can share some GIF. And then the next one is, can I use um, hashtag to go viral? Well, um, as long as social media is concerned, uh, you can use hashtag to go viral, but it actually just depends on what hashtag you are putting. But unlike Instagram, like you know, you put hashtag on Instagram and other, and then it start referring you. Right now, the way thread was built is not actually to get followers and you will not be able to be getting trending content from your Instagram. But instead, you are going to be getting a lot of content that um, people from your geolocation are actually reading or searching for. That is what you are going to be getting. Now, if you notice, um, most of these people, I am actually not following them. So if I click right here, you are going to see follow. Now, um, what is happening is this. It's taking some data from my Instagram and then randomly showing me content. It's actually not showing me content of the people I'm following. And it's also not showing me content of um, my friends or people that my friends are following. But it's actually randomly giving me all of this content to feed on. And then another information is, can I use multiple account on trades now what this means is you know like on your instagram you can log into multiple accounts this is actually not applicable for um it's not actually applicable for trades on trades you cannot use multiple account right now initially you can always click on this area and then you can see option to switch account but now there is no option to switch account instead when you click on account you can see deactivate profile take a, a break um, provision and other information but you cannot see an information to actually switch your account so this is actually quite different from Instagram and there is no option for that particular option yet so um, all, that is actually all for today's video and this is all that people are asking for so far and if you have any question I did not cover on, to, on this video please leave it on the comment section and guys I will see you on my next video I really appreciate you you are awesome Thank you for staying this long and I will see you soon. Peace.